Hello everyone and happy Planmas Day 19. Oh my goodness, we're getting closer and closer to Christmas and closer and closer to the end of this year. So today I wanted to show you, I set up my daily planner pages for the rest of this week, which is going to get me through Christmas Eve. Now, on my daily planning, I really do like the bulk of each planning day on that day that morning. But there's, um, we got a lot going on this week because we're having a, an ugly Christmas sweater party Saturday night. And then Sunday, we're having some friends we're doing a Christmas Eve breakfast with. And then Christmas Eve, we are getting together with Ryan and Teresa and the kids and Teresa's family and having like our big Christmas, our big family Christmas on Christmas Eve. Not sure of the time yet, but so we got a lot going on. So there's a few things that I've kind of um, pre-planned out for the week, but for the most part, I will be going day by day, but I do have all of my happy planner, uh, planner pages all set up. And I did use this week, the happy planner uh, daily planning inserts because I wanted to do a lot of different things with the backside with the dot grid paper. So without further ado, let's dig into this little happy planner flank, Franken planner and check it out. So I'm going to turn it to today and I still have my little um, checkoff sheet here for all the tasks that I want to get done for our ugly Christmas sweater party. I think I have, I actually have a couple of these that I have completed like this morning, last night I did some things. So I want to go ahead and I need to go back in and take those off or mark them complete. This is just kind of like my master like task list. So today is the 19th and I actually did not do a daily planning page for yesterday on the 18th. Um, I, I overslept, so I didn't really get anything done before work. After work, I really just, um, I had dinner in the crock pot. We took Beckham out to look at Christmas lights. And then I came home after I cleaned the kitchen. After Beckham went to bed, I, um, cleaned up the living room, vacuumed and shampooed the carpet. So there was no reason to even use a planner page for yesterday. So I did start with today on the 19th and I just blocked off my work time and made my list of my tasks that I wanted to get completed today. And I've already got a few of them marked off. And we're gonna take Beckham tonight to see more Christmas lights. I think we're gonna try to go somewhere different every night this week and take him to look at Christmas lights. And this morning I just wrote on my gratitude was, I'm grateful for getting to host a party again. And that's because um, we moved to Fort Myers, Florida and we didn't really ever get to entertain down there because we didn't have anyone. We didn't have any family or friends. And then when we first moved back to Cartersville, um, if you follow my channel for any time and you've seen any of my previous videos, we lived in a home that had a horrible driveway. It was like straight up. Uh, you couldn't park on it. People would have to park down on the main road and walk up the driveway. It was just a nightmare. There was zero yard. Everything was just sloped. It was on the side of a hill. And so no one really ever wanted to come over. So now we are here. We had Beckham's birthday party, which was our trial run um, last Saturday. And it was a success. It was wonderful. Everything went great. So I'm just happy that we're gonna get to have friends and family over and get to have like a little entertaining. So for today on my grid, my grid paper, I just kind of created like a little, like a, like just a quick little layout of the week. Um, I used the days of the week. I split one for Monday and Tuesday because I already, Monday's over. 
and I already completed a few things for today. So I just gave myself kind of going from this master task list and just kind of broke down my task for the rest of the week. And as far as the stickers, these are everything. These are Timu stickers. These are Happy Planner stickers. And I believe there are even some Agenda 52 stickers that I used this week. I just had a whole stack of just random loose stickers with Christmas stickers on them. And I just decided to try to use them all up. So this one right here is for today, the 19th. And that's like my little master list for the week. And so I took from this and kind of went in the rest of the days and just kind of filled in the things that I had on my checkoff sheet. So for tomorrow, I made this little page right here. These are Happy Planner stickers. These are Agenda 52. And of course I used the little sweaters. And I put two things down that were on my list of things to do for tomorrow. And then I just left some little blank boxes tomorrow when I'm planning for tomorrow. I can see, you know, based on what I get completed today, what still needs to be completed, what I might be able to get done early before the day that I had assigned it to. So I just kind of created this little page right here. Then for the 21st, I created this little page and this is, I think these are Happy Planner stickers from the Seasonal Teacher sticker book. And I love the little gingerbread houses and the little pink. And um, I just have a little write it down box here, make a list. And then I wrote, um, my task for this week, like to pick up my grocery order, clean out the fridge, uh, set up my final decorations and wrap um, our gag gifts for the white elephant gift exchange. <coughs> Excuse me. Then we have the 22nd and I use some more of these little gingerbread houses and then I just use, again, these are all right here, uh, Happy Planner from the Seasonal Teacher sticker book. And I really haven't filled anything in around them. Just put some boxes down to write in and use the rest of the little gingerbread houses. The 23rd, which is party day, so I blocked off, like color-coded out the time when we're having our party. And I made this little sheet right here cause it's party day. So I put little sweaters, scarves, hats, and just kind of made like a little final to do section here for anything that pops up that day that maybe I'm not thinking about right now that I need to make sure I get taken care of. And then, of course, Sunday is going to be Christmas Eve. I know that we're having breakfast, Christmas Eve breakfast, with some of our friends. That morning, we are going to get together again with my son and doing like our family oh. Christmas. But I don't know what time we're doing that yet. And then on the 24th, I just kind of made this little sheet. This is a Happy Planner sticker. These are Happy Planner stickers. These little, um, like little uh, Christmassy stickers. These are Agenda 52 stickers. I think these right here are from a Timu sticker book that I got. And I just kind of created two little boxes here, shaded them in with color pencil. I wanna wrap gifts and I wanna bake some things on Christmas Eve to take um, you know, that are going to be for our um, Christmas, our family Christmas, and then of course have some things baked to have on hand for Christmas Day, which, and of course, you know, we have to bake cookies for Santa. And I'll just use this little Christmas menu right here. I'll either like write out what I'm going to make for our family Christmas dinner because I do work Christmas Day. I work 7 to 3.30 
yeah, I work 7 to 3.30, so I just really haven't done anything much with that far out yet as far as Christmas Day. I just put a little reindeer and a little Merry Christmas wreath on that page, so I haven't, we're not getting together with anyone. We'll be doing like Beckham's Christmas here at home. I will be working, um, so we really don't have anything specifically planned going on for that day, so the bulk of everything we're going to do for this week, Christmas related, is going to be Christmas Eve and the 23rd. So Saturday and Sunday is going to be basically when we celebrate Christmas. And so I will fill this in again as I get closer to that day when I'm making my actual plans for the 24th. But this is my daily, daily planning pages set up for this week leading up to Christmas Day and I think they all turn out really cute and I love how they're just all focused every day on tasks to do to get ready for our little Christmas sweater party and getting ready for Christmas Eve for our family Christmas get together. So anyway if you've made it to the end of this video as always thank you so much. You know it means the world to me when you take time out of your day to watch my videos. And I hope that you have an absolutely amazing plan, Miss Day 19. And I will see you tomorrow for day 20. Bye.